Six months after it was forced to close, Boston's Museum of Fine Arts is ready to reopen to the public. Locals and visitors alike can look forward to the MFA's reopening on September 26th. But as you can imagine, there will be some changes. WBZ's Paula Evans spoke with the museum director today about what visitors will see. Paula? Well, David and Lisa, the MFA was hit hard by the coronavirus pandemic, shut down for the longest period of time in modern memory, and forced to lay off more than 100 employees. But now the museum says it feels confident the MFA staff has taken all the right safety precautions to bring visitors back on September 26th. Masks must be worn by all visitors except the very young. A social distancing floor decal, decals have been added to the exhibit rooms and flow signage has been put down to encourage one-way traffic. Museum Director Matthew Teitelbaum told me that he feels reopening will help the community heal. Well, I think it does. I think that art has a great capacity for healing. It has a great capacity for reflection and therefore giving comfort. Um, but it also, the museum also gathers people together. And I'm going to say, I think there's comfort in being together. The museum will admit just 75 guests each hour. Visitors will be required to purchase timed entry tickets in advance. Good time to go see some art. David and Lisa. All right.